Alright, I just received an order for two million kilts to be delivered to the Andromeda Galaxy. What? <laughs> um... Uh, alright. Hello, and welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon Uranium Gender Lock. My name is Ectric, and we are here in episode 11. And we just took down the Garlic Kid in the last episode, the superhero for Pokemon. And we are going to be continuing on to the west, I think. Um, actually, let's check our map real quick to see where we're supposed to be going, because I have no idea. But if you're enjoying this series so far, consider liking and subscribing. Really helps out the channel, and you'll catch every single episode of this series and all of the other ones as they come out. But without further ado, um, I'm guessing this is not the right way to be going right, so we have to go left. Okay. So I think we go left to the Pehar Hills, and then we go to either Legend Town, or we go up to... Oh yeah, Beale Beach is the, the one we want to go to next to, so we go west and then north. Also, what's this? Roach Fails Tunnel. Okay. So that is where we're going this episode. Um, so if you're excited, leave a comment and let me know what your favorite Pokemon is from this gen because um, I'm I'm enjoying the uh, fake mons so far. I would have to say probably my favorite so far. Um, I do really like Repellent, um, the Turlard. Um, but I also like the Avidin, um, Sherm. I don't know. Gonna have to gonna have to get some more experience with some of the other mons before I make my final decision on what my favorite is. But thus far, those are probably my two favorites. I've already fought you. We gotta go west. So um, we have already gotten our encounter in this area, so we're good there. Yeah, we already got our encounter here. Oh, guess we get didn't fight this person though. Nothing like a quick battle in the morning, right? Let's go. Right. Yeah. It is actually the morning, so that's kind of cool that they knew it was the morning and decided to say it was the morning, but... Let's see. Um, so this is... Electric, so we'll go into ground. I probably should switch into, uh... Fire Dillo more, because he's a little bit lower leveled than Repellent. But still, um, Repellent will work just fine here. Okay, so what does Repellent have? Oh right, Magnitude. See, that's the thing. Magnitude's such a good move compared to Mud Slap that I kind of want to use Repellent for ground-type moves. I'll still use uh, Fire Dillo for, like, Grass-types and stuff. Okay, send in Kostra. I don't know what that... Oh, we fought one of those last episode, I think. I don't remember what it was, so we'll just stay in with Repellent. Right, okay. Well, we'll kill this thing. This should be poison type, right? Yeah, yeah, we're good. Okay, cool. Way to go, Repellent. Making this team nice and uh, strong. Would've been nice to have you for the second gym battle, so I didn't have to stress about it so much, but... Alas. Hmm. I'm just going to try and avoid as much grass as possible. Um, ah, wow. Good vision. Dang. Oh, well. We'll fight you. Last Sora. Oh, like in uh, Kingdom Hearts. Okay, so this is just a pure normal type, right? So... Purunga? Um... Or do we go into one of our stronger mods? Or do we just keep with Kato for now? Oh, uh, let's do a Thunder Wave first. Alright, Yon's fine. Okay, we'll Thunder Wave it. Should be good there. Now it's slow. And we'll, uh... I guess use Thunder Shock, see how much it does. Oh, not bad. Okay, I can dig this. I'll, st I'll stick with Kato for now. Oh, actually, that does 9 damage. 
So five would be 45. Yeah, no, we're not staying in with this one. <laughs> Jeez. Fury Swipes is a scary move. I hate it so much. Um, who do I want to send in? Uh, let's send in Repellent. He's our second strongest. He's got Magnitude. It should do good damage. Hopefully we get a Paralyze on this Flung. Perfect. Okay. So, we're gonna fight. We're gonna use Magnitude. Only Magnitude 6, but it should still do some decent damage, right? Yeah, we're good. Okay. It's gonna try and put me to sleep, but we should kill it before that happens. Unless we get, like, a Magnitude 4. Or 5. Uh... Okay, we still killed it. Good. Um. Oh, Perunga grew to another level. Nice. Alright, Repellent fell asleep. That's fine. Luna Pup. Um, that is a Rock type, I think. Or no, it was Ground type. So, we'll switch into Sherm for this one and use uh, Hidden Power. I still can't believe that I got that lucky and that uh, Sherm's Hidden Power is Grass type. I mean, granted, we had, like, a 2 out of 19 chance, considering it could have also been water, but still. Nice. Alright, down goes Lunapop. Are we done? Minion. That is Poison type, so we'll go back into Repellent, I guess. Wake him up with a berry or something, and then we'll uh, attack this thing. Or we could just wait for it to wake up. Let's just wait. Why not? This thing's not going to do anything to us, right? Right. Alright, that does 22 damage as a crit, so... As long as we're above 22, we should be fine. Alright, we can live one more. I should have just used a berry. Oh well. Too late now. Let me heal up with a push on. And then we'll, I guess, just use a... Well, might as well save it now. We've already spent three turns and it could be max five. Oh, there's the crit. Let's try that again. <laughs> okay. Now we'll use a... Ah, we'll just use the berry. Ah, uh, just a resto, so we use this. Wake up minion. Or not Minyan, Repellent. <laughs> Minyan's the one we're fighting. Okay, so... That did 12 damage, so we should be careful that, like, 24... We're, we're above 24 at all times. Okay, we'll use one more potion after this, and then we'll start attacking. I probably should have just used uh, a super potion, but, you know. It's fine. Don't poison. Ah, of course I poisoned. <sighs> Smile. Die. Magnitude 9. Good. <laughs> Kill this thing. <laughs> Alright. Nice, nice, nice. And we defeated the lass. Take that, Sora. Now let me just uh, use a an antidote or a berry to heal up this uh, poison, because I'm not dealing with that crap. And we'll also switch... Oops. I meant to switch, not uh, try and <laughs> heal it of poison that it doesn't have. Okay, switch. Let's put Fire Dillo up front for a bit. Get him some levels. Grab this. Oh, perfect. That's useful. Don't need to go over here, we can go up this way. Um, I'm gonna try and get around this guy. And obviously I'm also going to, uh, run from this. Because I don't feel like fighting him. Uh, stop it. Okay. We're good, we're good, we're good. We got away. Um. Hmm. I'm trying to see where I, I really need a water type on my team. That would be really useful. Because right now we're kind of stuck when we when we need water types. Or when water types would be useful. Like, 
ground is still kind of a problem for us. And rock, I guess we could use repellent for rock and shrimp for uh, fire, or not shrimp for fire types, shrimp for rock and ground types. And who, oh, I would use uh, repellent for something that we would need uh, for, no, 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 Gra I'm trying to, I don't even know what the hell I'm trying to say. Never mind. Water would be useful. <laughs> Holy crap! Could not think of anything that I was trying to say there. All right, so this is this bug rock, um, or bug ground? Let's try ember. See what it does. It's bug, so it should be at least neutral. Oh, it's super effective. Okay, cool. And we got the burn off. Okay, so it is bug ground looking like. Sand Tomb's not that strong, so I think we can stay in. Especially with a with the burn, it'll do half damage. So I think we should be fine. Okay, yeah, that was a crit, so 20 damage with a crit, we're fine. Oh, plus the Sand Tomb, though. That'll also do damage. Whew! Alright. Oh, shoot, I didn't check what it was. Whatever, we'll go into... Term. Better safe than sorry. Put it put in our highest level. Make sure we're uh, all set there. It was a manky. Perfect, actually. <laughs> Alright, Gust. Man, got lucky there. Lucky it wasn't like something stupid that had shadow tag and would have been really bad for sure. Like a Gerbata with with a uh, arena trap or something. Okay, um, hmm, this is not the, can I, oh, this is a subway. Alright, I can't go that way, because, you know, they're blocking it. Um, oh, there's a tunnel now. Okay, let me, um, heal up my team as much as possible before I go take on this trainer. Good, and Kato. Okay, and then we want a berry to heal up the sleep on Kato, right? Do we have another berry that can heal sleep? Oh, this is a full heal? Okay, that's useful. Um, paralysis. There we go. Baku berry. Beautiful. Alright. Oh, shit. Hmm. So I can't use that one. Hmm. Interesting. So I can't actually... Oh, I guess I can't use them outside of battle. Okay, whatever. Alright, I just received an order for two million kilts to be delivered to the Andromeda Galaxy. What? <laughs> um... Uh, alright. Interesting. Well, this is a rock steel type, so... Probably should get out of here, because rock is super effective on us. Ground is quite, quite effective on this thing, though, so... We'll use it to uh, kill the deer... deer rule. Poor Takadamanye. All dead and stuff, because of my idiocy. Right, this should do good damage. I miss Takadwanya. It was such a good name for Amon, and he was so good. Ah, it's got Sturdy, that's why. Okay. Would've been useful to have Sturdy on Takadwanya. Um, let's do a quick slash. There we go. Down goes Deerold. Wow. Sounded like a shy guy. <laughs> hey, Prunga's getting up level. Ooh, Seismic Toss. What is that? That is that the one that no that's vital throw is the one that automatically uh, a target is thrown using the power of gravity inflicts damage equal to the user's level. Oh, um, you know what? Actually, let's get rid of scratch for that because um, that still will be useful for catching mons at least. So we can send in um, 
Purunga for the, those the the catching mons after we paralyze it with uh, Kato. So we've got. Let's put Kato up. Actually, let me um, let me take the berry off of Kato. Item take. Good, and then we'll just use a full heal to uh, get rid of the sleep. Alright. Perfect. So now we'll switch Kato up front so we can get a power off on this Mon that's in this cave coming up. And then we will switch into Purunga and use um, Seismic Toss. It's perfect. Alright, Roachvale Tunnel. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? A Gligar! Wait, do we already have one? No, we don't. Uh, darn it. Uh, this is ground and flying, I think, so we can't even use Thunder Wave on it. Um, let's switch into ground and flying, actually. Um, <laughs> I don't like either either Purunga or Kato for this, because it's, it's probably going to have a flying move then. Stands to reason, at least. <laughs> and, uh, Purunga is weak to flying. So, I guess we could just go into... Hmm. Let's go into Fire Dillo. Because we can use Ember and hopefully get a burn off, I guess? I don't know. Let's see, what does it got? Hard. Okay, that's actually useful. I could use Scratch on it and not do too much damage to it. Yeah, let's use Scratch. If it keeps using Harden, we can just use Scratch and whittle it down really easily. I could also probably just try and throw a ball at it and see how it does. Okay, that was a crit, so we'll just keep scratching it until it's down low on health. Alright. Good. Alright, so while we, while we wait for this, we can kind of just think of a name for Gligar, because um, I think I did, I named one of them Disco Dan in the Pokemon Black Randomizer, uh, Fifo Lock, and I'm, I'm kind of inclined to name it Disco Dan again, because that's kind of a good name, but, um, I want to also try and th maybe think up of a different name. Hmm. It's like sticking its tongue out, which is like, it's like, yo, I'm crazy, Blah. So, maybe I could name it, um, hmm. It's sticking its tongue out. What also sticks its tongue out? <laughs> well, lick a tongue. But I could name it Lick a Tongue. <laughs> That's one of my favorite pastimes is naming mons after different mons. <laughs> we could also name it Nick Licky Licky. Um, ooh, Licky Nicky. How about that? Licky Nicky, I think, is what I'm going to name it. Yeah, I'll name it Licky Nicky. Alright, that's fine. We'll scratch it again. Jeez, this is doing nothing. Um, we can live one more even if it's a crit, right? That does 14 damage. Oh, that was cutting it close. I don't like that. Um, let's switch into someone else, because it seems to be doing more damage to us now. Um Fury Cutter shouldn't do anything to Sherm. So let's just start chucking balls now. Because I think we'll be good there. Okay, harden again. That's fine. Do we have a physical attack on Chirp? We don't. Okay. We'll just start chucking balls then. Alright. Pokeball. Go! One. Two. Three. Click. There we go. Licky Nicky. Yeah, all right. We were correct as ground flying, so we wouldn't have been able to paralyze it. I'm glad I switched out when I did. Um, okay, so we are going to name this thing Licky Nikki. Yeah, perfect. Okay, well, let's continue on. Oh, wow, I guess I did use a lot of mods. 
Hmm. So now that that's the case, let's switch Shrimp up front just to... And then we'll use a Repel so we don't have to worry about it. Because um, I don't feel like getting any more encounters and running into a bunch of Mons. So let's use ourselves a Repel. And get ourselves through this cave real quick. Real quick, like... I wonder how many trainers and how long this is going to be. Because I'd really like to get through this quickly, if at all possible. Like, this could be... Oh, I was gonna—I was gonna be really excited if that was it. Um, go. Oh, okay. He <laughs> didn't look. Um, it's looking like I'm gonna have to fight this guy though. Doesn't look like he turns. You want to turn, bud? No. Okay. I'll make you turn. Do you know how this cave came to be? Who cares? Let's fight. <laughs> Battle me. Just. Like the T the TFS uh, DBZ short. All right, so this is ground flying. So hidden power would be neutral. Let's just use gust. Quick attack. That's fine. Okay. So that should yeah two shot. Perfect. One more quick attack and then it dies. Is it going to have any other mons, or is that his only one? I hope it kind of hope it's his only one. That'd be nice. Sharp, good. Uh, another Gligar. So this is ground flying. So... Perunga would be bad for this. You don't really have anything for it. You're weak to ground, and not super effective on flying. You are, don't have anything effective. We'll just stay with Sharp. Yeah, this is kind of a... Like, this is where water would really come in handy. Having a, having a water type, we could just send it in and... Um, kick its butt. Oh, that took more damage than I thought it would. I don't like that. Let me heal up just to be safe. Um, We'll use a fresh water. Oh, we've got a bunch of super potions. I didn't even realize. I didn't realize I bought that many. <laughs> I mean, useful. Definitely useful, but I, I didn't realize I had that many. Definitely gonna have to buy some now. Or not buy some, use them. I don't need to buy more right now. Good, that crit did 21, so we can live another crit from here. Not that it matters, because the Gligar's dead. <laughs> die, Gligar, die. Um, Barul. Let's go into... Rep how long are Purunga for this? Um, let's go into Repellent, just in case it has, uh... It has Sturdy and attacks us back. I don't want to send in Purunga into that. Alright, Magnitude. Magnitude 6 should still kill. We were so cl close to getting a Deer Rule, weren't we? Yep, had Sturdy. Called it. Headbutt. It's fine. And slash. Good. Down goes the Barul. I'm gonna constantly miss Takadwanye. I really hope I can get another uh, Bar Barul or Tirul uh, encounter. Stand for this. Um, let's heal up to full just to be safe. Um, I don't want to risk uh, having it have sturdy and then getting. Uh, one-shot crit by this thing with a headbutt. Right, that does 10 damage, so 20 is a crit. We would have lived it from there, but... Oh, God. I might not even need... <laughs> might not even need Sturdy for this. Yeah, no. That was terrible. Way to go, Repellent. Um... Okay. Come on. There we go. Now it's dead. It doesn't matter. It would have had Sturdy anyway, so... Two shots no matter what. Might as well get the four... Four, uh... Magnitude 4 is out of the way when it doesn't matter. Okay, cool. So you're dead. Any more? Oh, yes! This game has uh, repeating repels. That's perfect. Oh! We made it out. Route 7. Ooh, it's like 
an interesting mix between like the desert music from Emerald and like a Caribbean vibe almost. It's like Arabian. It's really cool. I like it. Do you heal? Yay! Thank you. All right, we've restored your Pokemon to full health. We hope to see you again. Thanks, lady. I appreciate that. Okay, let's go grab this item real quick. A great ball. Perfect. Now a turn. Thank you. Um, did the repel wear off? Now it did. No, I don't want another repel. Ah. Uh, hmm. How do I get this item? Can I lure him out? Oh, I need to be one more forward. Darn it. Ah. Wasting my time. Kokoran. This would be kind of a cool mod to have, I think. Is this bug ground? Or is it just bug rock? Is it bug rock or is it just bug? I really need to figure out the typings on these mods. Okay, so... Water gun. Bug water? Really? If it's bug water, I'd love to have this thing on my team. Such a cool concept and... Be able to have a bug type and a water type on the team? That'd be really helpful. Uh, this is the brain fish one, I think, so... Yeah. So we'll use, uh, hidden power on this thing. It should kill. Uh, I guess it's not stab, so... Alright, one more should do the trick. One more hidden power. Uh, oh! I guess it did just raise its special uh, defense a lot. One more. Again. <laughs> Let's try that again. There we go. Now it's dead. Take that, Braille Lip. Um, ah, I did put us to sleep. Darn it. Uh, Folarog. Is that the uh, evolved version of um, the... Is that the... I, I don't know what it is. It's the, the, like the four, the four tog one. Is, is that the de-evolved version and it's poison water? Uh, poison water. I kind of want to stay in with Shrimp, actually, if it's poison water. Yeah, it definitely is. All right, so let's just use a full heal to get rid of this sleep. And then we'll just use uh, Gust. Poison Stone, that's fine. I would send in Repellent, but if it's got a Water-type move, then he's going to be weak to it. Alright, of course we're poisoned. Uh, Alright, Gust. Oh, that didn't do that much. Alright, let's, uh... Heal the Poison. Actually, um, let's use a Super Potion first, and then we'll heal the Poison. Good. So it's got Pound, Poison Sting, and then what else does it have? Let's see, Persim... Confusion, no. Um, I guess we need to use an antidote here. I don't think we have any berries that heal poison. Oh, um, this is not good because that's our last one. And we only have one more. Please don't poison me again. Please don't poison me again. Thank you. Alright, um, let's use Air Cutter. Alright, good. Okay, just keep using Pound. That's fine. Okay, that was a crit. Let me use another Super Potion. Oh, boy. Alright. Poison really makes me nervous. Son of a gun! Stop poisoning me! Alright, let's kill it quickly before it, we get too low with poison. Dude! Die! Just die already! Alright, um... Gus will kill here. Uh, we're not gonna take any more damage this turn, just the poison damage. We'll switch out of Shurm if it's, the battle's not over. 
Um, mirror shot. What does that do? Um, I think it just does the same move back that the person, that the other person just used, or something like that. But whatever. I like my t my move set. Okay, cool. Let's see. Bag. We're gonna use our. Let's see if there's any berries that we do have that heal up poison. That's par paralysis, burn, PP, HP, confusion, any status problem. Let's use the- oh, this is just a full heal also. Alright, we'll use that. Cool, so we've got one more full heal. Uh, ooh, we got an encounter. It is Dupe's Claws, so we can run away from this and get a new one. Oh, shoot. Okay, Growl, that's fine. How is this thing faster than us? Alright, let me, um, heal up to full. Jeez, wasting all my healing items. Okay, we're good here. What is it gonna use? Okay, just keep using Growl all you want. Um, Hidden Power is special anyway, so... Fight! Hidden Power. Die! Die, Grozard. Go away. I already have your older brother. I don't need it. I don't need you. Goodbye. Okay. Cool. Now... Let's get ourselves an encounter that isn't a Grozard. Preferably a water type. Casnail. Interesting. And it is a guy, so we're good there. Um... Let's go into Kato for this. Because I think this is a water type. So we'll, put, we'll, we'll paralyze it, and then go into Purunga, I guess? Yep, water type. Perfect. Super useful. Alright, that did 14, so a crit is 28. We're still good there. Um, okay. Water ground? Um, okay, neat. So it's got water types, type moves. Let's go into Purunga. Water ground shouldn't affect us too much. We'll just use Seismic Toss. Why are you freezing? There we go. Uh, water Gun again, that's fine. That shouldn't do too much. I did 18. And that wasn't a crit. Why are you so weak, Purunga? Alright, um... I guess... Sharp and we'll just keep chucking balls and hope for the best? Man. Man, this sucks. <laughs> Bubble Beam. Okay. That does 12 damage. Okay. Um, Pokeballs. Let's try using a Net Ball. That should work well because it's a Water Type. Unless it isn't a Water Type and it's just using Water Type moves. One. Two. Three. Click. There we go. We got it. Cast Nail. Whew. Okay. This is definitely going to come on the team, I think. Ground Water. Yep. We've got so many Ground Types is the only thing. Alright, so it looks like a, a slug, but also like, well, it's mostly a slug. It's a water slug. Um, hmm. Slug paw, because it's a dude instead of a slug ma, which is a woman. Slug paw. <laughs> nah, nah, that's, that's, eh. Alright. Um, it's like a sand castle, so we could name it after a king. A water king. We could name it Zora, after the king of the Zoras from Zelda. Um, yeah, let's name it Zora. So, I just need to make sure I don't get any extra time stamps real quick. Alright. Zora. Beautiful. Alright. We will add that to the team once we get to the next town. So, with that... I think we'll call it an episode here, so I hope you enjoyed today's episode, I had a lot of fun with it, and if you did, consider liking and subscribing. It really helps out the channel, and you'll be able to catch every single episode of this series and all of the other ones as they come out. But regardless, I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day, and I will see you in the next one. Have a great day. Bye.